Hey, my Libras. It's Mama Sunny. I be forgetting the little nicknames that I be calling y'all. I know I used to call y'all wolves, but I don't remember the other nickname that I gave y'all. I don't know. But keep in mind that these are general readings. Um, the things I talk about may not resonate with you and it should be all right. Um, I'm just doing a reading just to see what's going on with the energies. Once again, these are generals. If you're interested in a personal reading, please check out the description bar below because all of my information is there. Just coming with my readings. I do talk fast. I do curse. And due to me reading for a lot of different energies, my readings can be pretty jumpy. And you're going to hear the sound of nature because I am sitting out here in the car because that's the only quiet place I have. So maybe some of you, um, you are in need of a quiet place. This is the second time I recorded y'all's video. I tried to record last night. Um, so maybe for some of you, you may go through some distractions during this time. Um, maybe for some of you, you're having issues with pests or noise. Um, you may not be comfortable with where you are at. Right now, y'all, I made some little tear cards. So this card popped out, fuck them kids. <laughs> <laughs> y'all may be having a hard time with your babies um during this time rather they are babies or grown um mm, so we also have flowers and gone too soon some of you that there, there uh, may be a death um rather it hasn't come up yet or there may be uh or maybe there was a past death uh, maybe for some of you, you feel like you're dying or you feel like you've lost yourself. And this may be a message from spirit saying you need to um, surround yourself with flowers, maybe surround yourself with nature. Um, if you can buy some flowers and put it into your home. If you want to do artificial or fresh flowers, that would be great. Some of you guys, you need to um, you need to feel lively again. Some of you guys, I am picking up that your best friend uh, wants to come in contact with you or um, you may feel the need to want to reach out to your best friend. Some of you, this may be the time where you truly need a best friend. Maybe for some of you, like you're going through a hard time right now. Pay attention to your dreams, okay? If you want to, baby, to code the motherfuckers and see what the hell is going on. Um, I just feel like, uh, so far with these cards here, I just feel like y'all need some space, y'all need time, y'all need fulfillment, y'all just, I feel that a lot of y'all, y'all have, um, either, either you've died in a sense, or maybe the past or the old you has died, and it's like you're trying to come to terms with the new you, so you may have issues with you going back to old habits, old friends, old lovers, because you were so used to doing and being that way. So it's like now you have to understand how to operate as the new you. Some of you, I don't know why I'm, that damn bird. Some of you, um, I don't know why I'm hearing the name Linda. So um, if your name is Linda, then maybe this is a message for you. Or there may be a Linda around you. This card also popped out too. I know y'all can't read my little scratchy hand, right? But praise your child or children. Um, maybe your child is, is seeing that you're stressed right now. And, you know, you may be kind of, you know, pushing your child off. So please, whenever you can, give your babies or your child praises during this time. Let them know that you are loved. Let them know that you are stressed and that mommy or daddy is having a hard time during this time. But just let them know that, that they are loved, that they are your angel. They're needed in this world. Whatever the case may be, just give them some good information. All right, last but not least, honey, we have the solar plexus chakra. So some of you guys be mindful of your digestive system. Be mindful of your digestive system during this time. Be mindful of the things that you eat. For some reason, I am picking up that some of you, you need to be mindful of you consuming too much alcohol during this time, either alcohol or soda. Um, or maybe some of you guys, you want to uh, consume alcohol or soda, honey. I'm picking up for some of you, there may be a pregnancy, like you may be pregnant during this time and maybe like your eating habits has changed or you were forced to change your eating habits. Um, on another note, some of you guys, you may recently found out that you're pregnant or um, you, you need to call back your energy. You need to call back your power. When I look back at the time, uh, it was 444. So look 
look that number up y'all some of you guys um understand that your angels are with you your deities your ancestors whoever you believe in or call you know they are with you during this time some of you guys you may need to call upon the four elements earth air fire and water um maybe you need to be mindful of the directions uh north south east west if you are interested in in rituals and witchcraft and all that stuff um, be mindful of the direction that you're facing into. Do your research on the different directions um, or where to put certain items in your home. Um, yeah. Once again, call your power back. That's mainly what I'm picking up for you guys with the solar plexus chakra. Um, for some of you, you definitely need to trust your gut and your intuition during this time. Your stomach, you know how like we get that funny feeling in, in our stomach, like something isn't right? If you don't know, your stomach is your second brain. Um, so yeah, be mindful of the things that you eat. Be mindful of what you're feeling and sensing. You know, if something doesn't feel right with you, trust that and understand that, you know, you're getting that message for a reason. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this 310. Good luck with everything. And I shall see you guys next video. Take care. Bye.